my study abroad experience in China. Last semester in spring 2012, I had the amazing opportunity to study in Shanghai, China at Vidang University through the Alliance for Global Education. At Vidang, I was part of the Contemporary Chinese Society and Language Program. I decided to study in Shanghai because the city has traditionally been known as one of the most important financial business centers of Asia, becoming known as the Wall Street of the East. In addition, Shanghai hosted, in 2010, the World Expo, opening its doors to over 70 million visitors from around the world. Shanghai welcomes every year thousands of foreign students and workers, but it is very easy to find a lot of diversity in the city. The students attending the Fudan program through the Alliance for Global Education can choose two different tracks. The first track is a contemporary Chinese society and language track. The second one is an intensive language track. In order for students to get admissions to both tracks, they need a minimum 3.0 GPA requirement, and they also need a full course load. And specifically for the intensive Chinese language track, as students need a fourth semester of Chinese language background. Housing is perhaps one of the best aspects of the Fudan program. The students are housed in an international student's apartment complex known as Dongha, adjacent to the Fudan campus with Chinese roommates. Each spacious apartment has two or three single bedrooms, a living room, dining room, kitchen, and one or two bathrooms. Apartments are furnished and are a short walk to the Fudan campus and classroom buildings. Chinese roommates are a special component of the Alliance Progress, and they represent a great deal in shaping the experiences of students in China because they help students make the transition to the new lives much easier. Furthermore, they become like family because they engage in many experiences with students. Last semester, I, along with other students from my program, gathered together with Chinese roommates to celebrate the Lantern and the Tingming Festival. During these two celebrations, we organized a family union meal where we prepared a lot of traditional foods such as the Tang Yuan and some many Chinese traditional folks to animate the environment. It was an amazing experience that I will never forget. Other unforgettable experience during my time in China was a long week trip sponsored by the Alliance to Yunnan province. At Yunnan, I visited its capital, Kunming, and other historical cities such as Dali, Lijian, and Sichuanbana. The highlight of the trip for me was a visit to the Tiger Leap Leaping Gorge, since our group was able to hike for about four hours and spend one night in this small house in the middle of the mountains. The view was breathtaking. Other aspect of the program that completely changed my life was the independent travel. I, along with a friend, decided to travel to Thailand for 10 days to visit Bangkok, Phuket, and Koh Phi Bi. In Bangkok, I visited many temples and famous monuments that are part of the historical heritage of the country. Contemplated the marvelous architecture of the different Buddha temples and the beauty of the Grand Palace in Bangkok immediately made me fall in love with the city. My experience in Phuket was a lot different, but it was also fascinating since I had the opportunity to take a safari and ride in the back of an elephant for the first time. The last place I visited in Thailand was Kofifi, a majestic island three hours away from Phuket. In Kofifi, I did not only have the opportunity to sail, but also to go snorkeling in different Virgin Islands. Overall, I feel that my study abroad experience in Asia through the Alliance for Global Education has been a life-changing experience that I would always treasure because every person and place that I encountered during my trip made a difference in my life.